So someone actually said these words. Keep in mind that this thought occurred to them. They then typed the words out. Not only that, but presumably they proofread their post. But then they actually clicked submit, effectively sharing these words with the world. Are you ready to see what Einstein level take we're dealing with today? If you don't like dogs, just don't interact with them. It's not that hard. If we could simply ignore dogs, obviously we would. I mean, really, has this person never seen or heard a dog in their lives before? What cave did they crawl out of to access the internet and post this brain-dead take that they aren't aware that dogs bark their stupid heads off around the clock? How can anyone not know that this is the only animal in society, or anywhere, that will literally run right up to us when we are minding our own business? Since you clearly are living a very sheltered existence, here is something you should know. One thing we absolutely cannot stand about dogs is their typical behaviour. For example, when a dog outside sees us walking by a yard, it will come running towards the fence, and it will jump or lunge towards us, all whilst barking menacingly and making other abrasive and terrible sounds. Many dogs have this reaction when they are being walked by their owners, and we're several metres away from them. The owner and the dog will often be where we need to go as well, such as on a footpath or sidewalk in the direction we are headed, or in the parking lot, or at the grocer. From our perspective, dogs are in our way, and they are restricting our freedom of movement. But the point is this. How in the bloody hell are you supposed to avoid something that loudly announces its presence all the time? How are we supposed to ignore something that comes running up to us uninvited? How in the hell are we supposed to ignore something that leaves its feces all over the place? This serves as one of many awful reminders of the presence of dogs, and they are inescapable. We even have to see them advertised all over the place. Even when dogs are restrained, or somewhat contained, they will not leave us alone. How are we supposed to ignore or avoid dogs? No, it is as I have said before. We would very much prefer it if we could not encounter them at all. However, you dog nutters make this physically impossible for us. You can't get too close to a dog nutter with a dog in tow, and this applies whether you're on a sidewalk or on a running track. Everybody knows that. And many of you nutters buy these preposterous retractable leashes that are so long you could be walking along in a Brazilian city whilst your stupid dog is harassing people down in Buenos Aires, still attached to the leash in Argentina. If you want to support this content and see more of it, please like and subscribe. If you hate this content and want to fight for weird predator parasites, here endeth the lesson. Go on, get the hell out of here. Get out. Get the fuck out of here! Listen carefully. Get the fuck out of here.